Hello, this is Rome. Let's practice the meditation. Find a straight back chair without arms. If you don't have a straight back chair without arms, you can sit on a sofa or any other chair, but if you can find one without arms, that would be nice. Sit in the chair. Put your feet flat on the floor. Let your right hand hang by your side. Close your eyes and look at the little pixels of light on the inside of your eyelids. Notice that your eyelids are not completely dark. When you look at the inside of your eyelids, you can see little pixels of light, little patterns of light, a warm glow of light. Look at that light. Look at that delicate warm glow, those little pixels or little sparkles of light. And as you watch those little particles of light, those little sparkles of light, also at the same time become aware of your hand. Just notice your hand very gently. Very, very gently give your attention to your hand as it hangs by your side. To help you to be aware of your hand, you can notice one finger at a time. Let's start with your thumb. Give your attention to your thumb. Gently notice your thumb. Feel your thumb. As you become aware of your thumb, it begins to tingle a little bit. Now give your attention to your first finger. Notice your first finger. Feel it tingle a little bit as you pay attention to it. Notice your first finger. Now direct your attention to your second finger very gently. Notice your second finger begins to feel a little warm, a little tingly warm, a delicate tingly warm as you notice your second finger. Now notice your third finger. Feel your third finger. Now notice your fourth finger. Feel the warmth. Feel the tingly warmth. Feel the little tingle in your little finger as you notice it. You may continue being aware of your hand one finger at a time as I speak. Or you may simply notice your hand. Your hand becomes tingly. You can feel life flowing into it. You can feel the blood flowing into your hand, into your fingers. You can feel the warm life filling your hand. Continue to be aware of your hand and at the same time notice the little pixels of light on the inside of your eyelids. Gently notice that light. Now as you are aware of your hand and you see the little glow of light on the inside of your eyelid. Thoughts will occasionally come along. A thought of what you did yesterday or what you have to do today, just some thought will come along and temporarily it will carry you away from being aware of your hand and of watching the little pixels of light on the inside of your eyelids. When that happens, just notice that it happened and then become aware of your hand again and watch the little glow of light on the inside of your eyelids. Every time a thought comes along, just notice that it's there and then return your attention back to your hand and to the inside of your eyelids. This is very, very quiet exercise, a very gentle one. No struggle, no strain. Just gently notice your hand. And when you do, you'll begin to feel it tingle and it'll feel flushed with life energy. And watch the little patterns of light on the inside of your eyelids. That's the meditation exercise. It joins you back to your inner ground of good from which you can flow.
and from which you will receive love and insight. And when you become connected again to your inner ground of good, it helps you to go through life without getting carried away by things. And it all begins with this very simple little meditation, learning to sit quietly in the present. And when thoughts arise to carry you away from the present, just notice that they have. And then you'll be back in the present again. Your contact with your inner ground of good will always be there like a pleasant strain of music in the background. And you can maintain it by practicing the little meditation first thing in the morning, then again at lunchtime, and then again in the evening, three times a day. And you can also practice it at moments during the day when you have a little spare time, even just half a minute. You can sit quietly and get centered by watching the little pixels on the inside of your eyelids by becoming aware of your hand, feeling your hand become tingly. From now on, you must always do what you know is right in your heart. You'll just know wordlessly. And if people pressure you to do something and it doesn't seem quite right, doesn't sit right somehow, then just notice the pressure. Let it stay on the outside. Just watch it. And it will pass. Then you may do what is right. And if what they ask you to do is not right, then just don't do it. Life becomes increasingly simple because you will have guidance, a mysterious, wonderful guidance. You'll just know whether to turn right or whether to turn left, whether to say yes or whether to say no. You'll just know it intuitively, wordlessly, just as when you were a little child, you saw things and knew things. But as time passed, you, well, you became emotional, and you got caught up in the world, and temporarily you were carried away from communion with your inner ground of good. But now this exercise, if you practice it on a daily basis, will restore you once again to your inner ground of good, from which you may flow and live properly. And you will find, not because I say so, but because you will see that it's so, you will rediscover joy again, and life will be good.